to Poetry IE Presents. Uh, tonight we're going to have fiction writing from basically all over the Inland Empire and abroad. Um, we're really excited. We have Meryl Fitel, Isabel Quintero, Ruben Rodriguez, Michelle Bracken, and uh, Pedro Schuler. Um, That's reality and this is realistic fiction. Um, but I'm going to get rid of the C word, okay? <laughs> Which is in here. It's okay. And I'll just re I'll replace it with crumpet. <laughs> Flaco, jump! The others call from the water below, craning their necks to see the plastic blue flamingo. It's a business that goes to empty lots and digs a bunch of holes and sells the holes out to rent space for time to people to lay in and or stick their heads in and hang out. When the man was 11, he had boxes of papers, certificates from school, notes from his teachers, the top math student, the boy kept all of his exams, even his times tables. He had so many boxes in his bedroom that he had no space for toys. For the Morris Award, which is um, awarded to debut uh, young adult writers, and so I'll be in Chicago this next weekend finding out if I won. I'm gonna find finalists, so I'm super pumped about that. Um, um, so I'm gonna read from the book. Um, it's in diary format. So we're just in her head. Uh, July 24th. My mother named me Gabriela after my grandmother who coincidentally didn't want to meet me when I was born because my mother was not married and was therefore living in sin. Mm -hmm. 